Think you gon' snitch, talk a lot Them gon' be your last snitch, words on the block When I'm not talk, I make a nigga nervous Told them drop his location if he got the courage Look what I got right here John Paul Gutierrez, Le Blue I already know y'all I was in my comments. Y'all was like, Chris, you gotta get the blue. You gotta get the blue. You gotta get the blue. And I was just like, man, y'all gotta hold on, man. Y'all want me to get all these scents. I just picked up Tom Ford Noir Duar. And look at the size I got. I know. $400. Crazy. I do it for y'all, okay? I always do it for y'all. So I finally picked it up. Do I like it? Do I like it? Do I like it? Let's get into it, okay? This is another before you bop. First of all, I'm Big Boss, if you don't know. This is where the players be at, if, you, if you're new to the channel. But this is a Before You Buy of Le Blue by John Paul Goudier. Let's get into the unboxing real quick. It's real easy. It's not, I can't even really even call it an unboxing. Let's call this an uh, uncanny. Uncanny. Ain't that like a word? Like, that's very uncanny. This is about to be the uncanny of this fragrance. All right, y'all, what's up? So. Look, man, you don't want to mess up. You got to take it from the bottom, okay? You don't want to break it. You don't want to get a can opener trying to open it like a can. You got to take it from the bottom. Look at that scent right here. You know what I'm saying? Love blue. Boop. Boop. How I look, don't it look cute? It's so fire. They kept up the same design. They always do when it comes to their body. But this dude is more sculpted and got a little, got a little starfish or a leaf over his package. But it's how I smell, first impression. Let's get into it. All right, y'all, so the first impression of this fragrance is that it smells, yeah, still smell that. It smells like, um, What's that? It smells like a pina colada, okay? A pina colada. Have y'all ever had pina colada? Sometimes pina colada can be like in a candy. Pina colada can be more so like in the drink. This is what this smells like to a T. So I'm, I can champion this scent already for just smelling like something that I smelled before, okay? Because if they was trying to smell like a pina colada, they did what they were supposed to do, okay? I love the color of the juice. I love that blueness. I love the, the bottle, okay? I am a, a little fan of this. I, I, I ain't gonna lie, like, pina colada? A fresh pina colada? Like, like, like pineapple, um, pineapple coconut? You can't beat that. That smells so good. Just imagine that, pineapple coconut. Like you want to beat somewhere. I love it. I just, I just I fucking love it, okay? So, with that being said, let me go ahead and show y'all the notes. Come here. Ah, these are the notes, okay? Check it out. I know. Yeah, it smells real good. It smells good. Check it out. I'm going to give you some time to break the notes down. Like I said, it smells like a pina colada. Okay, let's get these notes out of here. Ah, okay. So, Longevity. The longevity is not gonna last that long, okay? You're getting like four to six hours with this fragrance. The CI is just good as well. You're getting like maybe like a feet, a foot and a half with this because honestly, the citrus inside that pineapple, the citrus inside that coconut do resonate and mix with the air chemicals, especially when you're on the beach, okay? This scent is great for spring and summertime, but I can imagine you could probably still wear this in the fall and winter based off the sweetness that it has, okay? This actually got me a lot of compliments. I've been wearing it a lot. I only had this fragrance for a week and look at it. I'm, I'm killing it right now. I love this scent. It smells really good. So I honestly don't even gotta hold y'all up too much. Like I said, pina colada. Let me get just to the boss right because I want y'all to go pick this up. Welcome. All right, welcome to the boss right now, all right? So, like I said, the CI is good. The longevity ain't all oh, like that. It smell like a pina colada. I like the scent. You can pick this up at Macy's anywhere you want for under $100. I got this for like $96. Plus, that was plus tax, so it was really like $90. Damn, that smells so good. Also, if I was going to rate this out of 10, I will give this scent right here a 7.5 out of 10. If it lasted a tad bit longer, 
You know what I mean? So I'd been longer, I'd have been in there for the long haul, okay? I would probably got this a nine out of 10, okay? But it's a seven out of 10, I mean a 7.5 out of 10. It smells really good. I do recommend it because it won't smell like nothing else that's on your shelf. If I was going to pin this up to any other the blues and the other the males, I got them all up here. I honestly can say this is the most uniqueness out of all the Le Bleu. I mean, out of all the, uh, the, the John Paul Boudier line. This is the most unique. And it might slowly become my new favorite, but I think they have an auto Paul farm of this. I'm gonna go grab that, and that might be the my favorite of all time out of this. Cause I know y'all like Le Mail and whatever, but I kinda like this a little bit more, okay? Y'all like, comment, and subscribe. I'm Big Boss. If you enjoyed this review, I'm just so glad you even watched it. You know what I'm saying? Please come back. And don't forget, my scent came out. The Boss smells really good. If you haven't checked it out, please go check it out on the website. I'm coming out with lotion soon, body washes soon, candles, all with the same fragrance because people say they love that fragrance so much. Okay? I love y'all. Y'all take it easy. You know what I'm saying? Follow my gram. Comment below any other fragrance suggestions or reviews I should do. Okay? This is on with y'all.